Wow. Initiating. Welcome back to my daily grind. Create yourself is what you'll find me doing every day and every night. No time to lose. One day, one step in the right direction. I'm Chris and I'm only here to show you if I can do it, you can do it too. Welcome back to the vlog. It is Sunday, another day, another chance to push hard. And the topic for this vlog is wiring high voltage generators in series. So let's get it. By the way, all stupid experiments right here. Watch them all. But before we get started, love goes out to all my subscribers. Thank you for making my life special and for living to the max. So let me try to give back with a sweet, sweet video. Okay, so check it out. I already prepared everything. I have five big ones and five small ones and I decided that I will try the bigger ones. I will again use my DIY full bridge rectifier to power them. I also prepared the modules themselves. I removed the insulation a bit more and soldered all them tips. Okay, so the red ones. And the green ones will go to the other side, of course. This is already proving to be complicated. Let's go for an individual test first. Well, all of them at the same time. Will this even be possible? Let's find out. Whoa. Totally. What happened to the current? It's dropped to 4.5. Okay, that's not too bad, I guess. All of them seem to work. And now I will use these double clamps to wire them in series. And I also should keep an eye on the polarity. In you go. This will be the outer one. So let's check these. Hmm, let's keep on filling it up, I guess. I have no idea if this was the right phase. I think so, because it, it worked. Okay, so all of them are now connected in series. So let's find out how long this gap can be. That is mm, lame. Maybe this is the wrong polarity. Okay, I think I actually need to do it step by step. Okay, so we have two in series, hopefully. It works, but it's, mm, it's not getting longer. Let's try the other one. Nope, that was definitely the right way. Okay, let's add another one then. Let's see. This time the spark gap has gotten longer. This one with this one. Hmm, let's try the other way. No, 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 no. For sure the wrong polarity right there. Still not getting longer. What the heck is going on? I don't understand it. Am I doing something wrong? I don't get it. One last time. They are moving. This is crazy. Hmm, maybe this is the wrong polarity. No, I don't think so. This is lame. Why is this so lame? I was expecting something amazing. The spark gap is just not getting wider. Hmm, so weird. Well, that that was a that was that was not impressive at all. Well, sadly, that's enough progress for today. I plan on doing another one of these experiments with 10 in series. Who knows if this will be any different? I will still try it, even though it might be a bit lame. But hey, what can I say? Other than smash that like button, the way I want to smash these transformers for being lame. Bang the bell like crap. Pa. To never miss stupid experiments, check the recent news on chrisviral.com and yeah, that's it for today. I will see you tomorrow.